Okay, welcome back to Platform Games. This is lesson number three. What we're going to do now is very quickly, we're going to use what we've learned in in previous uh, lessons and I've shortened my window down because I'm going to make sure that I've got paint.net open at the same time. So you can see I've got paint.net open here. And what I've done is I've used the sonic sheet that we used before and basically I have used the select tool which is here. I've used the blue select tool so that means that I can copy and make new uh, sprites. I've used the move selection and also the magic wand. Now the reason I've done use the magic wand here again is you'll notice that when you open this sheet all this is white okay so I'm going to use the magic wand and I clicked into here and I deleted all the white that was in there so I just going to pick up my magic wand when I use my select tool uh, I'm going to select now I, I, if I don't have enough uh, uh, sprites for Sonic to run, then I need to make sure that I've got those. Well, you need to make sure you've got those. And basically, I selected uh, Sonic jumping, and I only use the three here because I just want him to jump up and down. I don't. We don't really need him to be doing too much. So I cut them out and I pasted them into a new one. So as soon as I had this, I make sure I get the blue. Out the blue arrow here, and it means that I can go and, and I can copy this, Control C, and then I go all the way over here, and I go New, and it automatically makes the size of my new sprite. So then I can go and paste it in. Okay, so that's Sonic pasted. I'm then going to go and save this, and I'm going to go save it in my folder with all my other with all my other uh, sprites, you can see I put it into my Year Five platform games or wherever I'm, um, wherever you, sh you should put it in your personal folder. Then it means I can go into my Scratch and I can now go and import all my Scratch uh, sprites. There's my Sonic sheet, and here I have got Jump, Jump Zero Two, Jump Zero Zero Three. Now then, once I've imported those, I've got them down here. So there's jump, and I've labelled them jumps one, jump two. What I can do now is in my script where I've got the up arrow key. If up arrow key, I want to switch to costume jump. Okay. Now that I want to go back to switch costume Sonic Run as well. So I'm just going to make this a, bit, a little bit larger so we can see what's going on. So I'm just going to move my window over very slowly, like so. And I'm going to turn the green flag on. So now I want him to be back to normal. So there we are. We have him jumping. Okay. He doesn't jump high enough for, for my liking at the moment, and I want you to jump, make him jump a little bit higher or a little bit smoother as well. That is your little task. What I can do here as well is perhaps, I'm just going to go shoot my window, is you can go and work out now. When he's coming back down, when Sonic is coming back down, where are you going to put the new, the other jump key? the other jump um, sprite the other jump costume sorry where are you going to put this in? are you going to put it in there? so when it's going back down you need to see if this is going to work okay that's your little task thank you